Thanks to all the wonderful Aptera investors, my fellow Aptera reservation holders, and our Aptera curious friends for tuning in again. If you are planning on reserving an Aptera, please consider using my link below to save $30 on your reservation. In this video, I'm going to recap the 26th week of Aptera's Accelerator program. My numbers are based on the July 29th, 7.15 a.m. update. Nothing I say in this video should be considered investment advice. I am not an accountant or financial advisor. Please do your own research before investing, and investing especially in a pre-production startup company is very risky. Even with the Accelerator program temporarily closed to non-accredited investors, their crowdfunding efforts continue to grow. Republic reports a little over $1.43 million raised, with a slight increase of $2,058 over last week. The Accelerator program has raised over $19.63 million. This brings their total raised to almost $21.07 million through crowdfunding. This means Week 26 saw an increase of investment of just under $106,000. This is in line with the average raised on a normal week's increase since the program was closed to the non-accredited investors. This brings Aptera's Accelerator program much closer to its original $20 million goal. With almost $365,000 to go, we could see them break $20 million in three weeks, even without reopening the program fully. This pie chart shows the cumulative amount raised by each week's group of investors. There has been an update to week 25, so that it's no longer the only week with no new investors, by adding one investor. Breaking out the changes each week into a spreadsheet shows that the investments were decently spread out. Week 24 only had an increase of $50 which is the lowest I can remember and is probably just a correction. Week 26 saw the majority of the increase with over $63,000 raised. Week 7 also saw a decent increase of over $25,000. Week 26 saw four days of investments. It was also the tightest range of investments I have seen so far with only $115.50 separating the highest and lowest amounts. Week 26 only added a total of seven new investors which is on the low end, but that is to be expected as people are probably anticipating the reopening of the program now that the Delta vehicle is back in the U.S. and Aptera plans on showing off the vehicle at a few events in the next few weeks. This means week 26 brings the total number of investors to 1,349. Aptera added seven prior investors to the program, bringing their total to 768 and no new investors. The percentage raised by new investors stayed at 45% of the total invested. The total raised from new investors stayed at $8.78 million. All of the investments were added by prior investors, bringing their investments up to $10.86 million. The average invested per person for week 26 was $10,566, as the range of investments went from $10,545 to $10,660. Therefore, week 26 did not have any effect on the overall program's average. This week, there was no change to the top 15 accelerator investors, but we did see some change in the top vehicle spot holders, which is a flip from last week. JR from Utah jumped from the 14th spot to number 11. They're still over $23,000 out of the top 10, but a lot can happen before the program ends. Thanks again for watching. Please subscribe, comment, hit the notification bell, like and share to help our channel grow. And below you'll find links to our website, evolveelectric.org, our Twitter and Instagram.